And what a year for Molly Pulaski, over 300 wins in her career. Boy, the fans getting rowdy and ready. Mills Godwin, Hermitage. This has been a rivalry, and it has been a seesaw fair throughout the season. Godwin won round one, Hermitage got round two. Now they're playing for the conference tournament trophy. First half highlights, back and forth we go. Hermitage, we've seen them, they can hit it from outside. Haas, Wilson Lamb. And then player of the year, passing it around. Both teams spread the ball so well. What a great job on the extra feed. Torres settles, and he didn't settle for anything. Hermitage with the early advantage. Godwin on the comeback trail. Don't leave him open. Carson Wiley with a wet chain. He nails that for three. Don't leave him open. That's good for three. Tim Cower and company knock it down. And then Hermitage getting on a roll early in the first. From the corner, corner pocket, yeah. Number four, Hodge Wilson Lamb again. 10 point lead at the half. Let's go second half. Godwin looking to get back into it. And they would with the help of Timothy Fisher. And it was a battle of the fives. It was Timothy Fisher, number five. Working wonders for Godwin. Number five, Ramon Williams for Hermitage. Humans like work inside. You'll hear more from Williams because he got a lot of points in separation late. Follow the bouncing ball though. Hard to do as a defense, even harder to stop this shooter, Dylan Thomas. He's not going down without a fight. And then scramble for the ball. Thomas, great pass. And it's rewarded. Number 15 converts. It's Bradley Thomason. Thomas. Thomas. Finding. No. But the rebound at the buzzer. Yeah, I count it. Scott McDonough. And after three quarters of play, it's a two point game. Yeah, only 29 27. A lot of good defense in this for all the offensive highlights I'm showing you. Tab. Boy, he makes big time buckets when it matters. It's that. Long two. And then. In the fourth, it was all Hermitage when it mattered the most. There's Haas Wilson Lamb. Boy, did he have himself a night. He and Ramon Williams, pretty exciting. To the rack. They hadn't won a conference tournament playoff title since the mid-2000s when I'm talking about Hermitage, but they're about to win one now. Tim Coward to the rack. Yeah, count it. They would call timeout. But let the dancing begin, because Herman Hens and Ramon Williams, oh, moving on to regionals. As they hoist the hardware, and Hermitage wins it 48-43, your final. Tonight was definitely a team effort. Um, you know, we, we dealt with some injuries in the beginning of the season. Uh, those guys coming back, you know, filled in. Other guys got a great chance to get experience when they were gone, and we kind of really Put everything together at the end, and that's kind of what you want. You prepare for the playoffs, and we're playing well at the right time. And um, they played really unselfish tonight, but they knew give up for your team. Your team's more important, and, the, and winning is more important for each other. So they played for each other tonight, which is really good to see. Playing as a team, talking on defense, and crashing boards. That was the main thing. That feels good. They ain't had that since 04, so it's exciting. Yeah, we're ready.